For the final time, it's a new ballpark here in 2022. It's a pregame edition of Tomahawk Talk. Ethan Frank, Max Tanzer, and Calvin Cristoforo in Hyannis, one of Calvin's favorite places to be. But Max, I'll start with you. Adam Tellick getting his final start for the Braves tonight, and he's really built on every start nicely this season. Absolutely. I mean, the ERA north of six, I think that jumps out to you immediately. But if you take away that one inning, that one fourth inning in his first start against Katuit, his ERA is south of 2-5. He's actually been been tremendous this year went four and a third of his last four to third of an innings work his last outing let's see if he can get through five tonight well he'll definitely need some offensive run support against the Hyannis team that has been on fire for the last couple of weeks Calvin and maybe the off day will provide you know maybe some rest for these born bats yeah hopefully a Braves offense that scored two runs on Sunday two runs on Monday both against Wareham we know those two teams love scoring the same amount of runs the Braves and Hyannis already tied this season, first and second in ties in the Cape League respectively. But for the Braves offense, it is just find a way to build off of the ninth inning against Wareham last time they played. The Braves were down 2-1 to one going into the ninth inning. They had a couple of hits. They strung them together and scored a run in the inning to tie the game. Other than that, though, they just scored in two of the 18 innings the Gateman and the Braves played. So stringing hits together, stringing runs together, and having more than just one big inning is a key tonight. First pitch is at 6 o'clock here tonight before the Bravos starts at 540, and we will see you there for the first time this season in Hyannis.